Friendly greetings, this is Bloodfang Clawtooth coming to you from Second Life. And this is another round the grid in in 26 days. This is the series where I take a uh, letter from the alphabet and find words or names corresponding to the to that letter and go explore the sim just as long as it's not adult or uh, a violent rp or a residential area then i'm fine i explore it in this case it would be pay hud uh, this is where you can get if you have the phoenix uh, breedable this is where you get all your phoenix breedable uh, uh, supplies place also has has a uh, pay hud uh, thing where you get paid lindens if you um, do a quest or something They also have some sort of fawn or deer breedable And how can you say no to something that cute? Over here in Palo Marian, a on the main grid, main land is Frog Town. Very scenic area with boarded up old buildings. Old school. Semi truck, a bait shop. Nobody's home. Only the owner can, can drive the truck. Swampy area. Dirt Road. Nice looking cafe. Our coffee is is Something experienced tart chalk, tart chalk, and ex experience that chalk is unable to convey. Oh. Little gas station, I suppose. Mm. You know what? I'm not really that hungry after all.
Rody's bar. This place looks pretty neat. Motel. Broken down old car. A murder scene. All the way over in Pandurus, Pen, Pandorus, from the mainland, is the Happy Hippo Building School. School where you go and, and you learn how to build, script, whatever for Second Life. One of the few building schools in Second Life that actually still exists. There used to be a, a whole mess of, of building schools that you could go in. Now, as far as I know, there's like two or three. This, uh, this place and Builder's Brewery and maybe even one or two others. You might even uh, find some some builders, uh, some uh, uh, school kids somewhere around the grid, if you're lucky. I don't know what Linden Lab's policy on on these schools, why they chased them out or closed them out. As far as I know, the uh, original scripting uh, school from, from uh, the scripting and music school is gone. If I, if, if, if I understand it, if I'm wrong, please leave a comment in down below saying, hey, you know, you're wrong. I won't be offended or anything. I tried scripting myself, but I'm broken, so I can't, can't figure out how to script myself. But learning, learning how to script is on a whole other level that I can't even math. Over in the region Papa on the mainland, we have Silent Scream Haunted House. And Papa don't preach, he haunts. Okay. I just got here. Tell me to get out, but huh? 
Grandma, she needs you snoring already. I didn't do it. And continue continuing our theme of haunted places. Over in this region, Paper Lantern, we have Cloud's Haunted House, Asylum, Dante's Hell, and more. Can't be too haunted, although Cards Against Humanity could be considered haunted. Gaming area. Russian Roulette. Over at Paradise Bay, you have a virtual landscaping company. Come get all your uh, landscaping needs for, for your home and, or business. I'd even go go as far as to say you could you might you may be able to get some pictures out for your Flickr account. Maybe there's a lot of advertising and and a lot of vendors set up. So if you can angle the camera to the point that, uh, like let's say. You come over here. And there's my thumbnail for the, uh, for this video. Or, if you don't want the, person in the video, no offense. Welcome to Paradise Island. One of the uh, Sims, if you're looking for real estate, you look up Miriam, Miriam Chang Estates. And this is one of her estates. Over in the, on the mainland, on, in Papa, you have a train station. You have a small, small hometown area. Come do some role playing, come do some, some flicker taking, taking. Over on the mainland in Perry, most people know where Perry is and what's what's related. Leskwood, one of the homes of of Leskwood furry avatars. 
one of the main main hall. We also have some residential area and some some public area. Nice trail running into some bam bamboo area. Less good. Furry Avatars is one of the oldest uh, furry avatars in Second Life, and their home is one of their one of the oldest homes there is. Very uh, inviting, uh, friendly area. No sex. Over in in Pirate Cove, we have Puka Farcaster Creations or PFC, and they have a, a Flickr group. Apparel, weapons, home, and accessories, as you can see. These weapons, I do believe, in the accessories section is non-scripted. I don't have a lot from from this place. Potions. Excuse me, I'm just doing a little window shopping. Money pouch. It's good. Dragon Slayer Roll Belt Roll Belt Is there anything for wine? Drunkard There's a drunkard The Hunter And there's the Vagabond on my wish list. Wink, wink, nod, nod. As well as the bones. Oh, this is where you get that. Oh. Okay. Yeah, on my wish list. All that shopping made me hangry, so I'm going to Pizza Hills, Unicorn Garden Breedable Auction Market. Beautiful area, but I don't see any breedable, any, uni, any unicorns. Oh, not looking in the right area. They seem to have a, a few other animals or, or chimeras. We also have Pegasus as well, do, besides the unicorns, and probably ponies and horses and whatnot. Oh, 
over on the same Plaza Grand Theater, we have the Plaza Grand Theater and Ballroom. A classy, spacious area with an art gallery, ballroom, and theater. Over in on the Ponytown Sim, we have we have the Bronies. Come here, do your role playing. Follow the rules and do some shopping. Over in the Portland Sim, we have Ashbury's, Ravenwood, and Special Impressions Crossfire Customs. Four stores you can shop in. Over in Prime 3D, we have a postmodern cyberpunk dis 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 dystopia. Big old cyberpunk themed shopping mall. Last but not least on the mainland on, in Finlight is Dementia Radio. It's not what you think. If anyone remembers this guy, please post a comment down below in the comment section. Subscribe, follow, hit the like button, hit the bell. Leave a comment about your favorite part of this video. And share and enjoy.